Silent Snapper and Royal Drag. <laughs> I wonder if Royal Drag is like you have to listen to her entire conversation or some weird shit like that. Because I don't imagine it would be like dragging her underneath your car or something like that. Because I would imagine that that's, that would probably fail the mission. Hey yo, what's going on? Our friend Poppy Mitchell has just been spotted in a high speed chase with the cops! Like, like right now, bro! Apparently she's wasted! Get after them! See if you can snag a shot of her getting busted! Sounds like a plan. Isn't she like the chick we took the I video of on? The video of, of her like getting diddled in the backyard and, and the crazy bitch like chased us and killed herself at the construction site. Cause really, it's not like she was wearing a seatbelt or nothing, so she totally would have been dead. Dead as shit. Yeah, this is some epic police chase music. Oh my god, they got a chopper on her and everything so should I like interfere with this this chase and and oh yeah I got my superpowers back I don't know if I should help the cops pull her over or if this is just like uh, you have to follow them a s oh dear god almighty I'm not paying for that shit really I don't think these guys pay taxes anyway, but I'm not paying taxes for that shit. Just because you guys don't know how to keep control of your goddamn cop cars and flip them over all the damn time. Not my problem. I'm not paying for that shit. But yeah, I wonder if this is just one of those missions where you have to follow them a certain distance and then she'll end up crashing or wiping out or... Maybe she'll just give up. Or maybe she just has a hot day to the casino. Alrighty. Oh no. Perfectly wide open uh, parking lot. Thought that was going to be the end. I thought she was going to corner herself in the parking lot. Oh shit. Oh god damn it. God damn it. I turned on my superpower just a little bit too goddamn late. You inconsiderate bus driving asshole. Yeah, well, at least I had pretty much a full tank, so I should be able to catch up. Unless I slam into something else. Damn it, Poppy, I'm just trying to ruin your career. Why you gotta be so inconsiderate? Oh, there we go. Oh, her special. There, there. Poor Poppy. Is that good enough? Hopefully. Even though I didn't actually get her arrested. Nice! Why would I get busted? It's perfectly legal if they're on a public street to take picture and video. Just because she's a celebrity don't mean a damn thing, man. No, they didn't get in trouble. Yay, Franklin! No, I didn't get any bonuses on that either. Whatever, I completed the mission. I'm happy. Gonna ring up Mr. Beverly now. That photo. What can I say? A great journalism. Our little sex tape said sloppy poppy and a full blown meltdown. <laughs> sloppy poppy. That be on the front lines, dude. Shit, it ain't exactly Iraq, man. And you know what? I might feel a little less degraded if I was fucking getting paid. Ah, all in good time. The truth comes first. I'll be in touch. You lying ass piece of shit. And actually, before we do a main mission, I am going to go see what Mr. Trevor is up to because when I was uh, flying around and stuff doing all the random races and whatnot, 
I think I might have found the area where the uh, bail bond person is located. Oh, apparently, Trevor's getting some nice booby action. Never mind. He's just getting drunk. Yeah, he doesn't really seem like he'd be that interested in watching the strippers. He seems like he'd be more of a alcohol kind of guy. I'm so freaking wasted, man. But yeah, one of the races that I did was at the quarry or whatever it is called. And I do believe that is the location of my... Can I get a cab? My, uh... I'm sending one out right now. Wonderful. Bail bond person. Should actually bring that email up so I can check it out. Uh, Maud, Mr. Ralph. Alright, so he's got the big old like weird thing on jiggers. And hopefully it stays marked on my map. I marked it as a point of interest. Even though I'd probably be able to easily. F oh no, it didn't stay marked. But I'm gonna say. Oh no, there it is. I'm gonna say it might possibly be this area. I'll probably be wrong, but this is the only area I've uncovered on my map that could potentially be the right area. And I don't know if you have a certain time limit to get these done or not, so... Oh, there he is. <laughs> There's a bounty on your head, and it's mine! Oh, shit! No! And I'm gonna die. God damn it, that, 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 that is all kinds of bullshit. <laughs> okay, so apparently I shouldn't have taken a cab here, because I just royally screwed myself out of my bounty. Where's John Marston when you need him, man? Aw, motherfucker. Yeah, we all knew that was going to happen as soon as I got there and he took off in his car. Oh, sweet. At least I got a decent checkpoint for once. That is always nice. Let's like sneak up behind him and knock him out or something. Sneaky sneak mode on. Oh shit, I'm not that sneaky. Don't pay me any attention, good sir. I am just here at the quarry for a nice friendly stroll. I love how he keeps turning around to wherever I'm located at. Like, he should have absolutely no idea I'm here yet. But for some reason, no matter where I sneak to, he is always looking in my direction. So I'm going to say I am not going to be able to just sneak up there and, like, Bop him on the noggin or something. Shh. Everybody be very quiet. Yes. Let's do this the easy way. You the hard dick. way ends with you on my boot. Yeah, let me just pop some of your tires before you take off. Ah ha! Fucking loser! Not sure exactly what the requirements are to get you back alive, but I'm going to try my bestest. Although, since I popped your tire, you could very easily wipe out and kill yourself. Come on, you slippery son of a bitch. I'm collecting my bail. Or whatever the hell I get for doing this. I'm assuming it's money. It probably won't be a substantial amount of money. But, you know, any little... Aw, oh, god damn it, Trevor. Learn how to drive, asshole. Please don't escape. Please. Apparently I should have shot out more of your tires before I let you get away. He's like not even... Why is this car so shitty? How is he getting away from me? He has a pop tire. I have no pop tires. But he is still getting away. I'm calling shenanigans. You come back and let me capture you, goddammit. Hello, good sir. 
probably just go ahead and try to pop some more of your tires while I can. Just don't want to accidentally shoot him in the face. Because that really wouldn't be very beneficial. Aha! Bitch. Yeah. Shoot you in the fucking head. Shoot him in the head. I'm in need of your vehicle. You're like getting in, right? Okay. I was going to be really upset with you if you tried to take off on me. Come on, pal. Don't do this. Just just let me turn myself in, please. No can do. I'm a dedicated servant of justice, my friend. Count yourself lucky I haven't trust you in duct tape and thrown you in the trunk. Yeah. Oh, now I've said it out loud. Shut you in the dick. The idea. Please, they're saying I could get five years. Five years! Aww. Whoa, whoa, hang on, remind me. What did you do again? You're giving off a sex criminal vibe. <laughs> what? No! They're just trying to charge me with check fraud, money laundering, workers' compensation fraud. It's crazy. It was just a few payroll taxes, for Christ's sake. Okay, I'm listening now. You had me at money laundering. What's your play? It isn't really a play. You create a shell company, take out a minimal workers' comp insurance policy. How much are you willing to pay me to not turn you in? The company is a dummy paper trail for their undocumented workers. I'm just a middleman, really. Whoa, 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 whoa. I take it all back. You are officially the most boring criminal alive. No, jail's the place for you for sure. For the learning experience alone. <laughs> no rush. I can sit here all day. Oh, I was hoping I'd get like some money and then I could take him to the cultists and I still haven't inducted anybody into the skulking around that quarry like a common toad anyway. You actually wouldn't find a toad in a quarry, it's too dry. Whoa! Are you getting smart with me, admin criminal? No, no, I'm sorry. I'm I'm just really nervous. Question my questions again. I'll slate your throat and let you gurgle the answer. Am I making myself clear? And one of the mining contractors I worked with said I could lie low there, okay? I've been sleeping in a bulldozer. You know, you're really not what I pictured. I've seen those bounty hunter shows on TV. I was expecting some washed up 80s pro wrestler type, but you're much, much scarier. Well, I was expecting someone much, much, much less of a pussy. I have to say, for my first bail jumper, you're a bit of a disappointment. Yep. I'm hoping serial killer. Maybe international drug czar, but no. Pussy, pussy, pussy. I get the payroll bandit. Pathetic. Okay, time to turn your ass in. No more chattings. Everybody shut the hell up. Hi, good looking. How you been, Trevor? Boy, am I glad to see you. Look what you brought me. She gonna rape you, dude. Your relentless sunny disposition, it always puts a pep in my step. I aim to please. Well, witty banter completed, I'll give you my thing. Yeah, money? And I'll send you another file for your inspection. I'd prefer money. You can totally feel free to give me money. Oh, I got ten grand? Nice. That wasn't too shabby. Won't it? Did over live. Oh, I got an achievement for delivering him alive. I don't even really see what the point of doing that shit would be. Be if you didn't bother delivering them alive. Ah, brother O'Neill. Fuck you, man. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. You're the guy stealing contracts. You clerked a farm, killed my brothers. Oh, was that me? Too many brothers. They needed time. You're fucking dead. Aren't we all? True that. True that, man. Can't live without starting to die. The hell's the the? Actually, I should just go home because all my outfits are available there. So never mind. I was gonna go to a clothing store, but home it is. We live and we die. That's our curse. Hey, you wanna expedite the situation? Come fucking find me. Vespucci Beach, Los Santos. You inbred hillbilly fuck. I'll be there, man. I don't know when, but I'll be there. I'm shaking in my panties. Where is your pussy cat outfit? I'm gonna assume he doesn't own any suits. 
Oh, so sad. No suits for you. Apparently he has some different outfits. Which all appear to suck ass. Except for the hunting one. That suits him quite well. Okay, where is your super epic outfit of epicness? I think I read online that the only way you can actually get him into like just his underwear is if you beat the game or something. Oh dear lord, that's pretty hideous. Yeah, whatever. Let's let's change it up for a bit. Go with the good old star top. Although I'm kind of partial to the pussycat outfit. Alrighty, what missions do we have for Mr. Trevor, if any? Oh, so apparently I can start the FIB mission with anybody. Alrighty, that's good to know. Looks like we have an in mission, Nigel. Isn't that that crazy ass British dude? Well, shit, might as well see what he wants. Probably wants me to kidnap us another celebrity for his wife to keep in their dungeon basement. I need a taxi as soon as you can. On its way, sir. Thanks for calling. Good work. Mr. Trevor's looking so patriotic in his star shirt. It's a thing of beauty. Do, do, do. Do, 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 hurry up, tax cab man. Thank you very much. Onward to my British brother from another mother. Assuming that is who Nigel is. Don't remember meeting anybody else in this game that would pass for a Nigel, so. I'm assuming it's the Brit. Crazy, crazy right, British yeah. Nigel. Alrighty, what do you require me today, you sick bastards? Why are you back here in an alley? I am all kinds of worried. Did you like accidentally rape the celebrity to death? 